Hello everybody, my name is Jordan and welcome back to another Cycle Frontier video. By the time you all are watching this, the non-disclosure agreement on the Cycle Frontier will have been lifted, which means that I can talk to you about all the juicy non-disclosure details that I haven't been able to share with you before. This also means that I will be able to stream the game, so definitely catch me live Tuesdays, Fridays, and Saturdays at 7pm France time. I'm super excited to finally be able to stream the game and show you all what I've been playing and loving about it. So, welcome to Fortuna 3, the new and improved Fortuna 3. As you can see from this footage, the game is beautiful. It is amazing looking and it just feels immersive and dynamic. And I freaking love the new creatures. The main creatures that you'll find on the planet are Striders, Rattlers, Marauders, and if you're lucky, a Crusher. Since I'm finally able to talk about the game, I'm going to be making a lot of content for new players. That includes tutorials, weapon guides, looting routes, and other important things that you'll want to know before you go down to Fortuna 3. I've put almost 100 hours in the game already during the closed beta. There are so many things to talk about with this game. I want to go in depth in talking about the weapons, the mods, the different attachments that you can put on the guns, um, the best ways to get K marks, um, which is the currency in the cycle. For those of you that are hearing about the Cycle Frontier for the first time, it is a game kind of like Escape from Tarkov or Hunt Showdown, where you go down onto the planet, you loot, you get resources, materials, weapons. Your main objective is to evacuate before getting killed. With those materials that you get on the planet, you can upgrade your player quarters and complete missions for the three different factions, Korolev, Osiris, and ICA. There's even crafting in the game, which means that if you can't find something down on the planet, you can use your resources to craft the items that you want. As you level up your reputation with the factions, you'll be able to unlock better guns and better equipment so that you can be even more prepared to fight monsters and even other prospectors. One of my favorite things about the Cycle Frontier is that there's proximity chat. It's so funny being able to meet somebody down on the planet and you don't know if you're going to shoot each other yet, but then they start talking to you and you can have a conversation with a random stranger and get to meet maybe a friend for life. I literally met somebody earlier today while I was playing on my lunch break and we had a chat up in this tower and we just talked for like five minutes until somebody sniped him in the head which turned out to be a team of two people, which I proceeded to then double headshot both of them. <laughs> so I avenged his death, but uh, we weren't able to exchange information quickly enough before they got killed. So if you found me today and I said my name was Jordan, leave a comment below because we should hang out. I really think that the direction that the Cycle Frontier is taking is a good one because the game itself is filling a niche in the market. You have a game like Escape from Tarkov over here, which is hard, it's difficult, it's frustrating, and then you have The Cycle Frontier, which is a little bit easier to get into, a little bit more simplified, and a little bit easier to just go in and have a chill time with your friends. And that's really what I like when I'm playing video games, is I like to have a chill time, I like to have a chill stream, and just enjoy myself and occasionally have some very tense moments. And that is what the cycle frontier is full of. It's full of tense moments and fun times. <laughs> Anyways, if you're interested in the cycle frontier and want to see more content like that, please consider subscribing. It would really help out the channel and we are getting closer to 200 subscribers every day. So thank you so much for the support. I really appreciate each and every one of you. You're my favorite part about making content. I will catch you all next time. Peace out.